when we liken ourselves to Hashem, when, do, when we do things like Hashem does them, when we react like Hashem reacts, and we're going to learn about his reactions, today we're going to have the first reaction, okay? When we react like Hashem reacts, we touch our higher selves. And when we touch our higher selves, there's no bigger gift we can give ourselves because from there we get all of our energy, we get all of our simcha sachayim, we get menuchas and nefesh, we get a soul that is calm and, and, and connected and present and there. We have something that most of the world doesn't have because most of the world is stressed. Most of the world is anxious. Most of the world is running around like a chicken without a head. Most of the world is not happy with all the things. Some of, most of the things are going on in their life that they don't have a handle on. Because when we are able to really identify with the godly part inside of us, which is our soul, which is our neshama, then we give it life. We give it food. We give it nutrients. We're literally bringing it back to life. That's our life force. That's where we get our energy from. When you're going through a hard period in your life, oftentimes you'll be very tired a lot. You have no energy. You're tired. You're always looking to get into bed in the middle of the day. You're tired. You can get out of bed. It's an emotional thing. How many hours does a person need to sleep? You already slept eight, nine, ten hours a night. The fact that you're still sleepy and tired is because emotionally you're drained. Emotionally, emotionally, and your nefesh, your nefesh is tired. And, the, and, and oftentimes people in that state, just feeling tired, feeling burnt out, feeling unhappy, feeling frustrated, all these things are in the nefesh and the nefesh is talking to us and the nefesh is telling us oftentimes, listen, I need, I need to breathe, I need, I need food, I need to breathe. I can't keep going on like this. I need you to give me food. And when you, are, when you are, do acts of godliness, you breathe life into yourself and all of a sudden you don't need to sleep that much. And all of a sudden you have more patience and all of a sudden you're okay with certain things and all of a sudden you're even happy. And all of a sudden you even feel the passion that you had in your heart for certain things. You feel life because your life force your life source is your soul. And when you feed your soul and you water your soul, it breathes. 